Okay. So here's my connected uh, temperature and weather display with my buttons nicely disconnected off to the side, but anyway, let's fire this guy up. Okay. So right now you'll see a little LED indicator up along the top just tells us which mode we're in. Right now we're in the glance mode, just showing the ambient temperature. If I click my mode button over here, it'll knock us into the detail mode showing current temperature, ambient, um, average, max, and min. Another click gets us into the current weather. And another click gets us into the weather forecast. And clicking past that just loops us around again. Um, it kind of remembers which state you're in, so if I turn it off at this point in the detail mode, let's say it's my favorite mode, I just want to leave it in there most of the time. If I turn it back on, it will return to that mode. And it'll do that with all of the other ones as well. Um, it will also sense alert temperatures in any of these modes. So let's say we're in this guy. If I heat up my ambient temperature past 80 degrees, it's too damn hot. And the same uh, kind of alert, but I think it's too damn cold <laughs> will happen if we swing down below my threshold temperature and those LEDs up top will turn colors, they'll turn blue. If we want to dismiss the alert, you can just get rid of it that way and we'll return. And it is on a little, um, what would you call it? A timer in and of itself. So it won't just continually throw the alert. I think it's on like a five minute snooze is what I have it right now. So um, yeah, you can dismiss the alert, but it, it will pop up again. And that's of course adjustable. But there you have it, P2.